Time of year where the spirit of giving is abundant, but some are in need all year long. 14 News is diving deep into the community to highlight local nonprofits in the tri state. We're giving you a closer look at how they provide crucial resources and how you can help in this special series 14 Days of Giving. Today we are joined by Suzanne Draper of Evansville's or Vandenberg County's CASA, excuse me, Executive Director of CASA. Yes. Talk to us about what CASA is, what you guys do for the community. Thank you, Jamie. Um, my name is Suzanne Draper, and I am the director of Vanderburg County CASA. CASA stands for Court Appointed Special Advocates. And basically what we do is we recruit and train volunteers to advocate for children that have been abused and neglected and involved in the juvenile court system. And so it's the season of giving, but we really want people to give all year round. So talk about the need for giving, what you guys need even. We need volunteers. Um, next year is our 40th anniversary, and we've set the goal for 40 new volunteers to help serve these kids because we have a waiting list. Unfortunately, we have probably about 250 kids on a waiting list, so we need volunteers. Um, we need, you know, we always need financial support because what we do is to become a volunteer, you have to be trained. And to be trained, we have to pay staff and supplies and everything else. So the training is 30 hours and uh, we need people to participate. So talk to me a little bit about what those volunteers would be doing. Our volunteers are very passionate. Um, they care about kids. They are kind of information gatherers. So they talk to the parents, they talk to the um, Department of Child Services case manager, they talk to the foster parents, they talk to relatives, anybody who's involved in these children's lives, they talk to and gather that information. And with that information, they make recommendations to the court and to the judge as to what is truly in the best interest of these kids. Certainly helping the children's yes. future. Anything else that you want to mention for volunteers or anyone who's willing to give back, anything that's valuable for them to know about Vanderburg County CASA? I think you just have to have a heart and you have to want to make a difference. What we do is truly making a difference in children's lives. Um, you know, no one wants to admit that abuse and neglect happen in our, it happens in our community, but it does. I mean, you can look at the news, you can look, you can hear about it, and what they do is they're there for the child. Everyone else is there for their own reason. We're there for the child. Certainly an important role for those yes. volunteers. Well, thank you so much for joining us for this 14 Days of Giving. Now, if you would like to have more information on Vanderburg County CASA, how you can help them, make sure you visit 14news.com. Thank you so much, Suzanne. We appreciate it. And thank, thank you. you for joining us on this 14 Days of Giving.